How to Install Spartacoat Urethane Cement Spartacoat Urethane Cement Flooring is a specialty high strength mortar and top coat resonance flooring system designed for extreme impact, abrasion, and thermal shock environments. Spartacoat Urethane Cement consists of four components including a Part A resin and Part B hardener, a Part C aggregate filler, and a Part D pigment pack. This advanced, thick mill coating system is found in areas where high facility floor uptime, excellent impact, and abrasion resistance properties are a must, such as commercial kitchens, food and beverage production, and breweries. Spartacoat Urethane Cement offers floor owners seamless, impermeable flooring properties, excellent durability, coatings equipped with silver ion antimicrobial technology, before applying Spartacoat Urethane Cement, the existing concrete must be shot blast to an iCry CSP 4 to 5. All concrete surface irregularities should be addressed, including cracks, expansion joints, and control joints. After surface prep, the concrete is ready to accept the product. Latacrete recommends mixing the urethane cement with a large mixer and a 6-gallon pail. Pour one gallon of Part A material into the pail. Add one powder pigment pack to the pail and mix for 15 seconds. Add one gallon of Part B to create a one-to-one -one ratio of A and B. Mix another 15 seconds until the powder pigment is evenly dispersed. Next, add Spartacoat Urethane Cement Part C filler into the liquid mixture and blend thoroughly until all particles are wetted out for about two minutes. Immediately after mixing, spread the Spartacoat Urethane Cement slurry onto the floor using a gauge rate set to the desired thickness. Be sure to maintain a wet edge at all times as this helps to avoid lines and ridges in the finished floor. Using a spiked roller, back roll the urethane cement to break the surface tension and to even the rake lines. Continue to rake and back roll material over the entire floor to even and settle the slurry prior to broadcasting. Broadcast quartz or flake media to rejection onto the wet slurry. Do not broadcast onto the wet edge area until settling and back rolling is complete. Continue broadcasting until no wet areas remain. After approximately six to eight hours of curing, remove all excess broadcast media and scrape floor as required. Finally, mix and apply specified Spartacoat top coat to lock the system and achieve desired slip resistance.